4.30 on the dot a.m., y'all. Let's go dig into some trash. Ow! <laughs> what that is? Something in the back there. Little piece of scrappity scrap, scrap, scrap. Yeah. Little piece of scrappy, scrap, scrap, scrap. Look at there. Some sort of plug or something. They're so probably little brass fittings or little brass things on there. Some more. Let's grab, let's grab, let's grab. Yeah, it's, it's these in his bags. Okay. Anything else? Lots of bubble wrap. Alright, get out of here. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Oh, what do we be having in here, man? Oh, I'll see a cookie. See if there's anything in that box. Where's my stick? Get my stick. It to be empty, man. Boo boo, man. <laughs> what do we be having in here, man? What in here? It looks like a little cell phone thing. My stick, get my stick. Oh, my stick. I wonder if that'll work for my phone, bro. Samsonite. Yeah, I think it's for iPhone. Check her out. I could definitely use one of them. Ow! Well, what's going on up in here? What we got? What we got? What my thick? Get a little box from the scrappy scrap scrap. What that be right there, man? Well, that's the butt end of my stick. The big old. What that is? What that is? Is that like a photography light? Norman by Photo Corporation. Yeah, these are like uh, tripods. Busted old tripods. What do we have in here? Oh. Man, these look pretty nice. Must be a photo studio or or something. See if any of these are still usable. Try to sell them. They feel legit. They look legit. What that be? What that be?
here. Oh, there's another one. Here, I go get my magnet stick. Yeah, the magnet can be a little problematic in these metal dumpsters, y'all. Then you just gotta get in. What do we got right here, man? That feels like aluminum. That's why my stick wasn't picking her up. A little bit of aluminum scabbies good, 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 good. All right. Ow! Look at all that crap, dog. <laughs> What's up in here, y'all? What's up in here? I think I see something behind that box. Got in here. Little scrabby scrap scrap. That is what that is, what that is. Ay, ay, ay. Ah, that didn't even look like that good of a board in there. Not worth it. Not worth it. Somebody's in trouble. Well, 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 what we got here? Free. I like free. What that is. Look at that. It's like a commercial oven. It looks good. It looks it looks like it's good. Look at that. Look at that. That looks Oh man. Well, let's get it. Ooh, that's maybe not so much. Oh. We got here what we got here ooh ooh that's stainless bro how heavy is this oven oh gotta be strong gotta be real strong we'll plug this sucker in see if she works that's a that's like a laboratory oven y'all and y'all are my witness, it said free. Yeah, O-F-I-T-E. I used to buy stuff from them. They do lab, you know, oil field laboratory stuff. What this is, what this is. Okay. We, uh, let me just back the truck up, hold on. Yeah, that thing's full of mud right there. Food out of here. That'd make a great, uh, a great bench. Make a really good bench. All right. 
let's see this guy these are stainless but uh let's see here they're full of some mud eh, that's not too bad oh, oh. some heavy stainless Dude, I'll try to knock all that crap out of there if I can. Look at that. Huh. Wonder if it'll fit in my truck. Let's see what we can do here. Nice little bookshelf. All right, let's see what. Let's see how strong we are today. Oh. Yeah, I could. I could sell these. We're not gonna scrap these guys. All right. Oh. Got drawers and everything. Hell, I'm gonna keep that for myself. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh, she's not sliding. Oh, jeez. There she goes. Yeah, that's a nice bench right there. Oh, I don't know. I might keep that. Actually, I'm going to keep that. Is that a shelf too? Or drawers too? Or... Oh, man. All right, let's see. Dead in there, dead. See if the little skinny bookshelf will fit. Oh, about collar a day, huh? That was quick. All right. Yes, sir. Daddy got some furniture today, y'all. Thank you, Mr. Free. Ooh, what that is, what that is? It's a big metal stick. That's a heavy stick. All right, let's cruise this guy. This is what I like. When they clean out shops, Good stuff, man. I've got enough speakers and speaker wire. Raid! Little basket. Yeah, put a quarter on it. Wonder if that's free too. It doesn't say, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna push my luck. But, uh, ooh, there's a sink. Oh, but it's freaking buried, man. Yeah, that ain't, ooh, look at that. Let's see what's on it. If there's any blackmail footage. Is that a faux beam? Check that out. Let's see what kind of wood is that? Just it's like pine. It's a nice boards. Oh, they're glued together though. We just tear them apart trying to get them out. Oh well. Can't get everything all the time. Ow! <laughs> what we got up here? I see a case. Y'all think there's anything in it? Should we even check? Nah, we won't check. Psych! I'm checking. Got y'all. Got y'all good. 
Lincoln. What's that? Uh, like Lincoln Electric? A grease gun case. Eh. Grab her. You never know. You never know who's, who's looking for a, a case for their grease gun, you know? What else we got in here? Just nastiness. Alright. Y'all check it out. My cell phone holder works. We're just creeping through the neighborhood on the way back to the shop, see if we find anything. I passed up uh, some over here. There it is. A little wreath. Good little guard cell item. Yeah, it's a little bookends. See this, uh, this good garage cell stuff. That's good garage cell stuff. Go. Oh. Little reef. Just throw this guy right here. What that is? What that is? Some sticks. Sticks. That's some pretty sticks. Got some pretty sticks. Bamboo sticks. Yeah. Sticks. I saw something, y'all. Hey. What are you doing in that box? What do we be having there, Teeter man? Is that a little uh, fireplace cover? A little scabby scrap scrap? And then that looks, I don't know what that's for. Oh. Maybe Grazo? I don't know. A little sticker back here. Ah, yeah. Alrighty guys, well another successful day of getting some stuff. As you can see right here, we got a few bucks and resellable items. Didn't do too, didn't do too hot in the scrap, but hey, scrap is the lowest form of value anything's worth. So if you can resell anything, you'll be making more money than scrap. So that being said, let's kind of go over what we found here. Uh, in the, uh, that one dumpster, we found all of these uh, tripods. I'm guessing it was a photography studio or something. They're all aluminum, but the majority of them seem to be okay. So I could probably sell all of these uh, as is, you know, some working, some as parts, and somebody probably give me, you know, I'd say 30 bucks, 20, 30 bucks, maybe 40, somewhere in there. Um, yeah, I mean, I think it's, you know, being that this was behind a, a, a nice place, uh, Norman, uh, that's probably a decent brand of, uh, you know, the tripods for the photography stuff. So, yeah, I'll look those up. Uh, but, yeah, those are probably worth a few bucks for show. Uh, I've got a little bit of the uh, the uh, garage sale stuff back here. Got a little wreath, a little fireplace cover, some decorative pieces there, you know, a buck or two. Uh, stuff would go pretty go real quick in a garage sale and then they uh, the uh, the hot lake of the day was the uh, the one that the free stuff um, Those are the best best places to hit is when they start cleaning out those offices And then they just they just start unloading everything. We found this little bookcase over here uh, Got to get a couple little pins for the shelves, but uh, I mean it's pretty nice. It's not solid wood It's MDF with laminate over it, but you can still probably get 15 20 bucks for it as it is and then this countertop up here, these are this is all all metal right here. It's got a little laminate top, got nice roller bearing drawers. Uh, there's a brand new shelf in here still in the plastic with the clips. So I'm probably gonna end up keeping this guy because it's in such good shape. And uh, I've been thinking about you know trying to build me a little miter station, uh, you know, for my uh, my miter saw. Uh, and then we found these guys right here. Uh, this is all stainless guys and then i was kind of concerned because the uh the other one over there i guess these tanks were down below uh it says cement but when you look in here it's it's pretty it's pretty muddy so it's it looks more just kind of like mud so what i'm going to do is i'm going to fill this up with water fill all three of these up with water let them soak over the weekend come back dump them out hit them with the pressure washer and then we got some solid solid stainless steel right here good 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 money there's probably this right here probably a couple hundred pounds alone right there that's 
good heavy duty stuff. And then this guy back here, this is what I believe these were under, uh, cause you see how dirty it is. This guy, I'm not gonna scrap out. I could probably get 10 to 20 bucks for somebody probably buy it, put a top on it, you know, I think it had a sink or something on the top. So yeah, we're gonna hang on to this guy cause you know, it's got the cabinet doors and cabinet doors are still in pretty good shape. Um, so yeah, pretty good there. A little bit of scrappity scrap scrap there. Let's see what we got over here. Um, oh yeah, and then we got this heater. I haven't plugged it in yet, uh, but it looks to be in pretty good shape. It doesn't look too bad. I mean, the bottom there needs to be cleaned up. It looks like little wasps started making a nest there, but let's plug her in and see if she works. Oh, okay, so well, the lights kind of see, yeah, the lights on here says heat cycle. Yeah, I think I can feel that was getting warm. Yeah, those, that's getting warm. This thing works, guys. And uh, they bought this from a company called OFITE. I believe it stands for Oil Field Testing and Instrument Equipment or something like that. Uh, it says Quincy Lab Equipment. I'll have to look it up, but I'm willing to bet money, guys, that this thing, this thing is easily over a grand. Uh, you know, new as it is, and then being as it's in such good shape, I definitely get, get somewhere in the hundreds for it. I'll have to look it up. Uh, the uh, OFITE part number is OF-OV-001, you know, oven. But yeah, it's by Quincy Lab, Model 40, GC Lab Oven. So yeah, I'll look up and see what that thing's worth, but I'm willing to bet being this is uh, laboratory equipment, it's probably really expensive. Good find right there for show. And then uh, just this uh, little guy right here, it's a little screen for the door, I guess for dogs or kids or whatever. And then uh, the uh, the little box here, Lincoln, it's for a, uh, I guess it's for a pneumatic um, grease gun. We'll see if anybody's interested in that. You know, sometimes the cases go pretty quick, sometimes they don't. Usually it's the drill cases that go pretty quick because everybody has drills, but not your average run of the mill dude is gonna have a high pressure pneumatic grease gun in his personal garage. So, but you know, we'll check her out and see. And then, uh, yeah, just a little scrappy, scrap, scrap, scrap. Just to finish off the day. So yeah, not too bad, guys, not too bad. Well, that's gonna do it for this segment of Dumpster Driving. I'm your host, Mike the Scavenger. As always, it was a total pleasure. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, hit the notification bell down below, stay up to date with the videos. Check me out on Instagram, I got one. We're gonna get back at it. Uh, Let's see, we've got a garage sale coming up, so y'all be looking for that video for sure. Do a little bit of the garage sale stuff. Probably do like a, the big, uh, do a big aluminum and stainless run, and then uh, throw the uh, garage sale in there. So yeah, we got a garage sale coming your way, guys. Uh, y'all take care. All right, love you all.